By the way, uh, we were going to have Brian on because things are a little tough in Hollywood, and he's picking up a side gig as a bartender and uh, got hired by Drake, and you were the uh, guest bartender at a surprise party for the uh, legendary musician entertainer Drake. How did that come about? Well, uh, a friend of ours, a restaurateur named Dave Gretman, um, who owns a bunch of restaurants down in, in throughout the country, uh, he said, are you guys available Monday? And we, we really weren't. We, we had to cancel a couple things around. We said, why? He says, because uh, at one of my restaurants, we're going to have, um, we're, we're going to have Drake and his whole party. It's a very intimate party. And it would be fun if you guys came over and, you know, bartended and, and made Dos Hombres mez Mezcal cocktails and for, for Drake and his friends. And it's like, yeah, I think we got to do that. I think we got to do that. So we kind of shifted things around. We flew into Miami. This was just last Monday. And uh, it, it, it's a, it was a fun night. It was a fun night. We're making we're making the cronies and old fashions mezcal and and it was fun to see him. And what a sweet guy. Talk talk about a different persona on stage as off. And I, I always look for that and I always respect and admire when I see someone who has is able to allow themselves to be seen in a in a calm, not performance mode kind of way. And Drake was just really a cool dude, you know, really fun. How was the house? Well, it wasn't, I mean, how many people, or do you mean that the venue itself? Venue. It was, venue. Well, it was a restaurant. Oh, okay. It, it was, it was one of the, the, uh, Dave Grutman's restaurants and they're just at open. Beautiful. Uh, and, who were the other celebrities there? Oh God. I knew you were going to ask me that. I was busy working. You know, someone's got to just get their heads down and, and put the ice in the well. So you did not know the other people there is what you're saying. No, I'm not. I'm not good at that. You know, you, you know, we're about the same age. And it's like it, I, I knew Drake and I, you know, I know some of his songs, <laughs> and, you know, and one of one of the uh, we were singing, it's like uh, one of the lyrics of the song goes like, um, uh, I, I live I live for the nights I won't remember with the, with the people that I won't forget. You know, and it's like it, it was it was it's cool. And um, so it's it, it was a lot of fun. We we danced. Uh, there was there was a lot of good food and it was just and really chilled because it wasn't overcrowded. It was very private. Um, it was just his invited guests. But he knew and, who you were like when. He oh, first yeah. Saw OK. Yeah, he he he's a, a big uh, Breaking Bad fan. So it was it was Fun to, and he didn't know we were coming. So we were behind the bar serving drinks and someone guided him up to the bar. And, and uh, we just said, you know, what can I get you, sir? And he went, <laughs> <laughs> but, like, but you're there, you're there with Aaron Paul, who was yeah. Jesse Pinkman. So uh, you, you two travel. I hear you guys are uh, cleaning Snoop Dogg's pool this weekend too. So you guys can be hired yes. out, which is pretty awesome.